Hey everyone, what's up? Jeff exclamation point here. And Sarah is here. Hi guys. All right, we are celebrating my birthday and we decided to do something that we've never done before. And we're at the Kennedy Space Center. It's gonna be fun. I'm excited. Never yeah. been. Neither have I. So this will be new. Yay! Yay, so we did it. We're in, we're in the gates. And we got like rockets and things behind me. So here we go, we're going to nature and technology. And we're gonna see what's all in here. It was small, kind of gave you the history of Florida and the land and the animals here. Merritt Island, where this all is. Yeah. So now we're going on to more adventurous things. Oh, look how they're keeping the birds away. So here's like the little eatery area and it's completely netted off. And to go in, you have to go through the little chains here. Yeah. Well, there we go, a bird-free zone. So this is where we're headed to, the Universe Theater. No clue what this is, but we'll figure it out. has only begun. We have dreamed big. It's an extraordinary flying machine. And it has been the stuff of dreams. Oh, the music is getting so <laughs> epic. It's so <laughs> This is actually really pretty with this window. And we're just going up the ramp here oh and it looks like we have six minutes we made it into the little pre-show room they have nice little benches for us to chill at Oh, this is really cool. So right behind me is the pre-show room. Yeah. They did the big reveal of... That is just so cool. Well, this whole room is just unreal. Oh, this is just too much. This is amazing. we're actually going to spend in here. Uh, we have an IMAX that we're going to try to catch in a couple of minutes. But there's a lot of cool exhibits here, a lot of things to learn and read. Oh my gosh, this place is just really cool. I mean, come on. Is it bigger or smaller than you thought? Bigger than I thought. See, and I thought it was smaller than I it was thinking. Really? Yeah. It's freaking shallow. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, it's still huge. <laughs> My god, those poor astronauts. <laughs> Hello. What's up? Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> and this is why I always wear shorts under my skirt. <laughs> Oh, 
Alright, so the next time I come here, I'm totally doing that. Wow, that looks like so much fun. And a little painful at the same time. So this is what we're doing next. Asteroid Hunters 3D! It's gonna be fun, and I gotta get my mask on. So we entered the building. They are trying to sell this popcorn in the back, which actually kind of sounds amazing. And we're gonna come over here and pick up our 3D glasses. Ooh, these are like legit. Ooh, some exhibits. And here are the stairs, and that's the theater. <laughs> and then I get my jelly ready. Oh my god, this would be so cool. There's a lot of things <laughs> you gotta think about and manage while you're, while you're eating up here. Astronauts are awesome. They have a giant the bottle of sriracha there. I love sriracha. That as well needs to get uh, attached to the table. So there's my peanut butter and jelly tortilla or sandwich. From here, I'll just kind of close it up. And enjoy. See if you guys can enjoy it as it's coming to you. <laughs> So we just finished the 3D movie. Uh, it was really good. It was just, it was about space. <laughs> That's pretty much what all this is. And it led us out into this little exhibit. I don't know what half this stuff is. It's just really cool. Yeah. The scale model is extremely large. So the real thing will be like crazy large. I know, don't you love my technical talk? Let's go in the Boeing Starliner here and uh, see what it looks like inside. Get the stairs. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. How would you like to be sitting in that thing? We're not gonna make it! We're not gonna make it! I thought you knew how to fly this thing! We made it! I knew you would. Oh my god, I hate you. <laughs> really? You had to pull dinosaur? <laughs> we're going back. We're not going back in time. We're going to the future, Jeffrey. Well, guys, if you're ever curious about what a space toilet looks like, here you go. Alrighty, guys, it's Sarah here. I kind of stole Jeff's camera. Oops. Not walk inside the splash, huh? And he's up in the International Space Station walkthrough area. And I'll show you guys in a sec. So I'm on the ground floor. He's way up there. There's Jeffrey! <laughs> oh dear. He loses 250 pounds and he can't do anything with himself anymore. Happy birthday to you. Hi, Jeffrey. Happy birthday to you. Oh, he's going to hate me for this. I promise you, that slide is probably one of the best things here. But uh, we are going to go experience something we haven't done yet. Yeah, we're going to the shuttle launch experience. It looks uh, really, really cool in here. You'll be riding a special module that fits right into the payload bay. But before you go aboard, we better go over a few basics. Just came off the ride. That's what the little simulator looks like. It pretty much uh, pitched us straight up 
and simulated a rocket launch, but without the crazy spinning that Mission Space does at Epcot. It was non-motion sickness-y for me. So yay! So if uh, you're know, afraid of the simulator and your family's riding and you don't want to ride, you can like sit there. And laugh at them. Yeah, and just watch them. That's kind of cool. I kind of want to watch someone. <laughs> and then you exit to this. Oh, that is. Okay, I just got very dizzy. Oh, that is amazing. So we're headed to NASA's space shop, world's largest, or space world's shop largest, we don't know. So we went to the gift shop. Gift shop was a success. I got a hoodie, a t-shirt, and some astronaut ice cream because, you know, you kind of have to. Uh, there's a lot to do here. <laughs> a lot more than I was expecting. Uh, so we didn't even really scratch the surface of what this place has to offer. But uh, it's getting near closing and Sarah and I are going to run and take some photos. And I'll put a few of those photos in right here. So this was a lot of fun today. Uh, I am now officially an annual pass holder here at the Kennedy Space Center just because there's a lot more to do here than you really have a day to do. Yeah, we easily spend five hours here and are planning to come back again. <laughs> yep. So anyways, uh, it's been a great birthday. I wanted a new experience for my birthday this year and definitely got it. But it's been a lot of fun. It was, yeah. I can't wait to come back. Yay! Come for next year's birthday. Exactly. That night, I think they do something for Christmas here. Oh, that would be cool. Yeah. We'll find out. But anyways, make sure you like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And gang, I'll see you next time. Take care. Bye! Bye.